Also monitoring the potential for some strong storms in the Northeast as we're on the air right now. In fact, a tornado warning just moments ago outside New York City. We're going to time this out. And in the West at this hour, another record heat wave. In fact, the third heat wave already this summer. Fires across six states tonight. Some of the images, the Beckworth Complex fire is now California's largest this year, scorching more than 130 square miles, three times the size of San Francisco. Firefighters battling the extreme heat and the flames unable to save every home. Ginger Z on the storms in the northeast at this hour, but Will Carr up first tonight on the scene of these devastating fires already. Tonight, the wildfires ravaging the west, creating some of the worst conditions firefighters have ever seen. The Beckworth Complex fire north of Lake Tahoe exploding. Driver, no! Swirling winds forcing these firefighters to run to their truck for shelter. At nearly 90,000 acres and out of control, it's the largest fire burning in the state. If it jumps fire line, we're, we're going to skedaddle out of here. And it's the second fire to ravage the town of Doyle in just the last eight months. I'm still kind of numb. I mean, after losing everything that I worked for and everything all, all these years, it's gone. In Mariposa County, the river fire growing by 4,000 acres in just seven hours overnight, now threatening a critical route into Yosemite National Park and forcing residents to flee. I hope everything is still there when I get back. The fire is driven by the third record-breaking heat wave in less than a month. Tonight, there are nearly 50 burning in six western states. In southern Oregon, the bootleg fire has doubled in size every day for the last three days. Tonight, it's threatening to take out a major power grid that connects Oregon and California. And at the Cedar Fire in Arizona, retired 40-year-old veteran firefighter Jeff Pichura and 48-year-old pilot Matthew Miller were killed when the plane they were flying to scout the fire crashed. Pichura leaves behind a wife and five kids. The NTSB is investigating. David, as we're seeing the extent of this damage, the winds have really picked up here this afternoon, and the heat's going to continue to fuel these fires into tomorrow. Comes as authorities are issuing a statewide flex alert tonight, asking Californians to conserve power. David. Just a horrible scene there. Will Carr, thanks to you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.